Hey guys this is Ganshim welcome to the WTN Celebrity. Music producer Noel Detail Fisher arrested on sexual assault charges Detail Fisher is a Grammy award-winning music producer who has been arrested and charged with 15 counts of sexual assault and five additional felonies, according to a media release from the Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department, LASD. Fisher was arrested Wednesday by members of the LASD for incidents that took place between 2010 and 2018, the Los Angeles Times reported. Fisher has had a history of sexual harassment and assault allegations from aspiring and successful female music artists, dating back at least to 2011, according to multiple news reports. Fisher is a Detroit native who told a reporter from Grind magazine that even though he started out small and was making very little money, he knew his music would eventually take him to better places. I started out in the streets of Detroit hustling beats, when you're good at something and people want what you have, you feel like a success, no matter the amount of money he said. I mean I felt like I had made it when I was dishing off $200 beats to the dope boys making music. I would take that bread, grab some more CDs to pedal my beats and keep it moving. In that interview with Grind Magazine, Fisher described himself as coming into the game with Kobe Bryant status. My beats just got better and better, everything I attempt, I eventually master so the progression just came about naturally. I moved out a lot to really get things jump in on the west coast, I couldn't really afford that law lifestyle yet, but I was living with Ray J for a minute. The opportunity to be the executive producer of Radiation was an amazing intro for me. I came into the game with Kobe Bryant status. As a music producer, Detail has worked with some of the biggest names in the music industry, including Jay-Z, Drake, Lil Wayne, Maroon 5 and Wiz Khalifa, KTLA5 reported, as well as Ray J, The Pussycat Dolls, Lady Gaga, Jennifer Lopez and others, as ABC7 reported. By the time of his interview with a reporter from Grind Magazine where Fisher was interviewed about his rising success, he had already worked with Jamie Foxx, Christina Aguilera, Usher, Snoop Dogg, Master P and Brandy. One of the producer's biggest breakthroughs came when he won a Grammy for Best R&B Song for helping produce Beyoncé's hit, Drunk in Love. The release of the song created some tension between Fisher and Atlanta rapper Future, as MTV News reported, because Future had helped develop the song's melody, but then reused it for his own single, which he scrapped after Drunk in Love was released. 2011, Fisher was accused of holding a woman against her will and sexually assaulting her, following a pre-Grammy party at his home in Canyon Country, California, TMZ reported.